Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a vlog. This is going to be a day in the life of a stay at home mom. So every day I wake up at 6 a.m. and I try to get dressed and do my hair, do my makeup, and just get myself ready before I go ahead and wake up my kids and get them ready for school. I do make their lunches the night before just to make my life a little bit easier, but I always try to get myself ready before getting them ready. So I had already done my makeup. I had just a few more touch ups to do and I was just doing my hair. So so then I went ahead and woke up my kids, got them dressed and ready for school. So this is going to be a day in the life of a stay at home mom. up to Madison school so if you guys are new to my channel my kids go to two different schools because they don't have a special education program for Yay. autistic kids in Ryan school so she can't go to our zone school she has to go to a different school that has an ASD level one which is what she needs to be in so she goes to a different school thankfully it's not far it's maybe like five minutes from Ryan's school and like seven minutes from the house so super close so I appreciate that I don't have to drive like super far for her but her school does start a little bit later than Ryan's which is good because there's no way I would be able to drop both kids off at the same time on time so I like that her school starts a little bit later Ryan has to be in school by 8 15 that's when his bell rings and then her bell rings I think at 8 30 pretty sure it's 8 30 that the bell rings for her so I have to wait a few minutes for her teacher to come out. Her teacher does come out and get her to walk her in. So we have maybe about five minutes before her teacher will come out. But Madison needed a change of clothes. Well, change of pants because she leaked through, right? Right before we left the house. We had a little leak. Right, baby? And she will not let go of that orange bottle where her orange juice was in. So we'll see what happens when it's time to take it away from her to go to school. Are you ready for school? Maddie? Good. Madison. Are you ready for school? Are you going to have a good day? Hey. I get ignored. <laughs> Is the bottle more entertaining than me? Oh, yeah? What else? What are you going to say? Is that how you feel about school today? Oh, what? The lighting was horrible. You look pretty today. See, mama, I always look pretty. All right, so I'm just gonna stay here for a little bit and then walk her up to the front. I still have to go home and finish my makeup. I just need to put on a little bit of mascara, but I wanna try this mascara. I do use the, this CoverGirl mascara, but there's a new one. Um, <clears throat> it's in a black tube instead of the gray tube that I use. So this is what it looks like. So I just bought it yesterday. 
and I had it in my purse so I'm gonna try that out and maybe see if I like it as much as I like the other one but I'm gonna wait a little bit and then bring Madison in and then I'll probably pick up the camera a little bit later so we'll see you guys in a little <laughs> now in target i'm waiting for my friend she isn't there yet so i just did like a quick like montage of the dollar section the valentine stuff to show you guys i did do a shop with me if you guys missed that i will link it down below but i am just looking around they have a bunch of new clothes they have a bunch of like crop top stuff but i still don't feel a hundred percent comfortable in crop top tees there's a ton of really cute stuff so i'm gonna shop around wait until my friend gets here and then grab some coffee there's a starbucks here in target so probably grab some coffee just walk around I want to go in to Dollar Tree and also probably Marshall's I'm not 100% sure but a few stores that we're going to just walk around and probably hang out for like two hours and then head back home so I thought I would pick up the camera since I'm in here today's workout was really good I'm super hot but I did bring my sweater in because I get cold really easily but right now I'm hot since I just finished working out but I'm waiting for my friend and then I'll vlog a little today's outfit of the day is this adidas shirt with these workout pants i got these from tj maxx on clearance and i got this on clearance as well i don't remember how much it was but this is my outfit over the day since i didn't do an outfit of the day at home and then these shoes are from walmart as well so so far i grabbed two tops probably to work out in but i grabbed this one that says fierce and fearless some clearance i think for seven or eight dollars and then i also found this one with a little tiger i thought it was really cute it's kind of like a crop top I think this was eight dollars as well not sure if i'm gonna get them but i do have them in the car because they're really cute but now i'm in the kids um section looking at shoes my friend's on the phone with her dad so i'm just looking around she's in the aisle right there but there's a ton of kids shoes like these shoes are really cute these are on claren for seven dollars maybe i'll grab stuff for the kids but still in target I think we're gonna run over to Marshall's and also Dollar Tree like I told you guys earlier. I'm not sure, but we're just hanging out. I probably will go straight to picking up the kids after this just because I want to hang out as long as possible. So most likely just have to get the kids straight after this. But I want to show you guys those two shirts. If I do end up getting them or anything else, like I said, I will show you guys a haul. But I did want to show you guys these shoes because they're super cute and I can't find Madison size. They also have these. These are really cute as well. And these, I think they're the same price. No, these are a dollar more than those pink ones, but they're still really cute. What do you have? Who's calling you? My mom. Nana's calling, answer to Nana. We are in the toy aisle that's on clearance. Clearance toy aisle, they have a ton of stuff. Right now, I added a few more things. I added some shoes for Madison that are on clearance, two unicorn shoes. And then I grabbed two bins. Still need to grab the mop, but we're looking at toys right now. Ryan's birthday is in a few weeks. So I need to get him a few things. So we're gonna see what we can find. Ryan's birthday is in a few weeks. His birthday is the first week of March. So I thought I would pick up a few toys while I'm here because there's a ton of stuff on clearance. We're not gonna get him anything too big just because um, we are buying him tickets to see Jurassic World, which is going to be super expensive. So that's his main gift is Jurassic World. Um, and then we'll have a few of his friends over, like three friends. We say he can invite to have a movie night pizza party. It'll be three friends and whoever wants to spend the night, they can spend the night. But I do want to get him a few toys. So we're in the clearance aisle. Not that he needs any more toys, but he needs something to open. So 
and a few things. All right, guys, so I'm now back home, obviously. We ended up going to Hobby Lobby as well, but I didn't vlog when we were in Hobby Lobby, and then we didn't have time to go to Dollar Tree or Marshalls, so maybe I'll just go another day. But I did want to show you guys a really quick haul of what I bought. So at Hobby Lobby, I only bought one thing, and I bought this drawing tray. So Ryan loves to draw. If you guys have been following me for a while, you know my son Ryan, who is about to be seven next month. He loves to draw, and he's getting so good at drawing. So he doesn't have like a little lap tray where he can draw, and sometimes he wants to draw here sitting on the couch and he can't so I got him this they only had pink and yellow I wish they would have had like red or blue his favorite color is red but they only had um obviously pink and yellow I didn't get him pink so I just got him yellow this was $6.99 but I had a 40% coupon so I used that on this and it's really cute so you can draw on here and then you can put like all of his markers pencils crayons everything on the side so I'm gonna give this to him for his birthday just because his birthday is next month. We're not doing like a huge birthday party for him this year just because we are taking him to Jurassic World. They are on tour and he loves dinosaurs. He loves Jurassic World. Those tickets are pretty pricey, so that's like his main gift. And then we'll probably let him pick out one toy from the store. But I still want him to open a few things, so that's why I got him that. And then I also got him two other things. And I think I also have some stuff hiding in the closet for him, like very small knickknacks, but I wanted to pick him up a few more things. So I got him this also untamed ferocious silver tooth um i don't know it's a little toy he has one of these and he loves it he doesn't have this one and it says that it makes 40 sounds and it was on clearance for four dollars and 48 cents it was originally 15 dollars, so i grabbed him that and i just dropped that and the last thing i grabbed for him was this he loves stuffed animals i've never seen this but it's called springlings bounce fly and surprise it was originally eight dollars and i got it on clearance for two dollars and 38 cents so it looks like it's a green little stuffed animal in there so i don't know he might love that he might not but i thought that was really cool so i grabbed him that as well and then for madison even though i'm pretty sure no i grabbed one more thing for ryan i'm lying okay i also found this from the lion king and if you press it he talks and i thought that was really cute so this was on clearance for two dollars and 98 cents it was originally ten dollars so I grabbed him this. Like I said, he loves stuffed animals. So I thought that would be really cute to gift him for his birthday as well. These next two things is for Madison. I found these on clearance for $3.98, originally $8. Now this is a 4T, 5T. So hopefully it'll fit her. I'm not sure. They look kind of big, but she's in a 5T right now. So we'll see if I got her. I'm not sure if they will even stand her feet because she's always taking things off. But grabbed her that. And then I also grabbed her these shoes, which are going to be too big on her they are a size 11 but i'll just save them for her until they do fit her and these were on clearance for seven dollars and 48 cents originally 15 dollars and i just thought they were really cute so i grabbed her those and then for myself i found this shirt on clearance originally 13 on sale for 6.48 and i figured i can just wear it to maybe work out with some like high-waisted um workout leggings or even maybe wear it with like some high waist distressed jeans or shorts for the summer just to like run errands. I thought that was really cute. So I grabbed that. And then the last few things I grabbed, I did buy um that mop. I don't know if I showed you guys, but I bought a new mop and I also bought two bins and pampers. That's boring, so I'm not gonna show you guys that. I bought these dum-dums for Ryan's Valentine's for his class. It comes with 50. They also come with cards, but I I got him cards already, but got some dum dum pops and then i also got a big box of skittles and this one comes with 25 and it says candy and stickers so i guess it has stickers in there as well and it comes with 25 i think there's 23 students in his class and then since he loves jurassic world i just got him these jurassic world valentine cards it comes with 32 and then i'm gonna go to dollar tree and I'm gonna get like little goodie bags so I can throw all that in the goodie bags for the kids. And then I'll probably pick up one or two things from Dollar Tree to throw in the Valentine's bag as well. But that is everything I got from Target. Now I need to quickly warm up some lunch because it's 1.54 and I have to leave in about 15 to 20 minutes to pick up Brian and Addison from school. So see you guys in a little bit. I'm also, when I get back home, I have to unbox a table. So I'll unbox that and put that together for you guys so you guys can see it's a really cute side marble table that I received from an amazing company called Nathan James. So I'll do that once I get home and then I'm not sure what we're going to do for the rest of the day. I was thinking about taking the kids to the park because it's a really nice day out but I think I'll text my husband to see what time he's going to get home and if he's going to get home early then maybe we can just um 
go up to the tennis court. I don't know, but we'll see. I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so I am now back home from getting the kids from school. It is around four o'clock. Brian's upstairs watching TV. Anytime the kids get back home from school, I give them like an hour of just downtime where they can watch TV, go on their tablet, just relax for a little bit before we do like practice work if they have any practice work or homework and then um, dinner and stuff. So I was gonna take him to the park or the tennis court, but Ryan said he wasn't really feeling well. So we're not gonna go today. It's supposed to be nice the rest of the week as well. So maybe we'll just go another day. And this is so bright. I don't know what's wrong with my lighting. I don't know what's wrong with my camera. The lighting is horrible lately. And then also I just filmed something and the vo there was no volume. And I thought it was just like on mute, but the volume was gone. So I just had to refilm it, but that sucked. Hopefully this footage right here, the volume won't be messed up. But anyways, I'm about to unbox the table I was telling you guys about. And I also want to show you guys the mop that I bought. If you guys follow a lot of other fellow YouTubers, they use this mop. A lot of people use this mop. They're always raving about it. I've been wanting to get it for a while, but I just don't know why I haven't. And when I went to Target, they did have it on sale. It was only like $5 off, but I decided to grab it. It's originally $30 and right now Target had it for $25 and this was the last box they had. So I went ahead and grabbed it and I'm super excited to use it. I don't know who's excited about getting a new mop. I am. So I'm excited about this new mop. I'm going to use it maybe later on today. I did sweep up the kitchen. I cleaned up a little bit. I unloaded the dishwasher, cleaned the dishes that were in the sink. I took up all the kids like jackets and sweaters that were downstairs and then I swept the kitchen as well. And then now I'm about to um, take some stuff out of that bin. So I did buy two bins as well um, to take some Christmas stuff in it because as you guys can see, that bin behind me is overflowing with Christmas stuff. And then I have a few things upstairs that are not even in a bin. So I need to put that in a bin as well. And then that's it. Um, this is gonna be a day in the life because I'm pretty sure I already have a lot of footage. Although a lot of it's probably me talking. Hope you guys don't mind it, but this will probably be like a day in the life. But anyways, I'm gonna show you guys the mop really quickly. And then I'm going to go ahead and unbox the little, it's like a nightstand side table. So I'll unbox that. Hopefully I can put it together. If not, if I need like some special tools that I don't have on hand, I'll just wait till my husband gets home and have him help me. But I'll at least unbox it and show you guys. It is by a company called Nathan James. I have collabed with them previously in the past. I'll try to find that video and link it down below for you guys. They're an amazing furniture company that sells amazing furniture for great prices. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, and then I don't know what I'm gonna do after that. I'll probably get the kids to take a bath. Are you thirsty? Do you wanna say hi to everyone? Say hi, how was school? Mm. How was school? Is there any water in there? All right, I'll show you guys the mop, unbox the table, and then we'll see what we do for the rest of the day. All right, guys, so this is the mop that I was talking about. Like I said, if you follow any other YouTubers that do like cleaning videos, a lot of them use this and they rave about it, and I've been wanting to buy it but like i said i don't know why i haven't bought it i went ahead and bought it i'm super excited to test it out i'll probably use it tonight after the kids go to bed i usually like to mop my kitchen every single night so i'll probably mop the kitchen tonight with it i'll let you guys know how i like it like i said target has on sale right now for 25 it's originally i believe 30 and then behind here in this box is where the table is so i'm gonna go ahead and unbox that really quickly for you guys guys so i just finished putting together this little side table i should have known it was going to be easy to build um the last thing they sent me which was a bar stool a beautiful bar stool which i still have 
that was super easy to build. I did not need my husband's help. And same thing with this table. I didn't need my husband's help. Everything came in included, so I didn't have to get any tools of my own to put this together. The instructions were super easy to follow. It said it was gonna take about 20 minutes to put together, but it took me under 20 minutes to put it together. I was able to put it together in 12 minutes. So that is really cool. I love it. It's a really beautiful little side table. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks. Um, like I said, it only took me 12 minutes to build super easy. If I can put it together, anyone can put it together. So I'm gonna show you guys how it looks really quickly. All right, you guys, really quickly, I wanna show you guys how it looks. So the top is like a marble and it's gray and white, super pretty, very smooth. And then all these bars and the bottom is all a gold color. And it's just a really pretty piece for an affordable price. They have really great furniture and I'm obsessed with this. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it. Maybe in my bedroom or maybe downstairs here in the living room, haven't decided yet but wherever i put it i will show you guys where i put it and what i decided to put on top but like i said i think it's really cute and it only took me 12 minutes to right build guys, so that is the side table that i want to share with you guys it is a beautiful piece i just want to say quickly thank you so much nathan james for collaborating with me again i love working with you once again the bar stool that they sent me previously a few months ago i'm obsessed with we actually have in our living room right now and it looks beautiful in the house. Everyone loves it when they come over. They ask me where I purchased it from and I let them know. So if you guys are interested in checking them out, I will leave their links down below. They do have an Instagram page that has a ton of beautiful pictures of all the affordable furniture that they sell. So I will leave their Instagram handle down below as well as the link to this table and also their website. So you can go ahead and check them out and see what kind of furniture they sell. Like I said, it is super affordable and it's great quality. I love it. I'm also gonna try to find the video where I did the bar stool so you guys can see that as well. I'll show you guys really quickly, but I'm gonna try to find that video so you guys can check that video out as well, just in case you are new to my channel and you have not seen that video yet. But thank you so much to Nathan James. I am obsessed. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it. Like I said, I'm gonna play around with it and see where I like it the best. I'm thinking maybe even my guest bedroom because I don't have any tables in my guest bedroom, even though it's super small, but this table's really small. So it might look perfect in my guest bedroom, like in the corner, I'm not sure. But like I said, beautiful piece. It said it was gonna take me 20 minutes to build. It only took me 12 minutes to build. So if I can build it, anyone Please can. go head over to Nathan James' website and check out their furniture and see if you guys can find anything that you guys like. If you do decide to purchase anything, let me know what you purchased and how you like it. But I'm gonna go ahead and finish cleaning up the house and then see what else we get into for the day. So I'll see you guys in a little. All right, you guys. So just for now, this is where I placed a little side table. So I think I'm gonna end up putting it either in our bedroom or in the guest bedroom, just because guest bedroom only has a bed and one small um, dresser, but it's a huge disaster. So I wanna clean it up before I put that in there. So for now, I decided to just put it in this corner and then in the bottom tray down there, I just have one of our speakers. And then I figured when my husband sits here, he usually is always putting his drinks up there. I thought it would be easier for him just to put his drinks on there. And then maybe like the remote controls. So for now, that is where it is. I'm pretty sure it's not where it's going to stay. But for now, I think that looks cute in that corner. I also put a candle and like a picture frame there and it looked really cute as well, but I took it off just cause I know my husband's gonna probably end up using it to put his drinks, but I think it looks cute there just until I figure out where to put it permanently. And then I told you guys, I would show you guys the other piece that I received from Nathan James a few months ago, or maybe sometime last year. I'm not sure, maybe it was the beginning of the year. I'm not sure, but I'll link that video down below. But this is the bar stool that they had sent me and I put this together, it was so easy to put together. I should probably get another one so it can match right there. But for now, I just have one there and I love it. A lot of times the kids will just sit up there. Um, yeah, so I just like it. I have it there and I need to get another one, but that's how it looks underneath my little bar.
guys so now it is the next day and i just want to go ahead and close out this vlog i never finished vlogging yesterday so just want to say thank you so much for watching my day in the life of a mom of two so i know my kids really weren't in this vlog very much it was majority of me talking to you guys and going to target and stuff like that but there are some days that my kids just don't feel like being filmed or i'm just super busy and i completely forget to pick up the camera throughout the day like yesterday, I kept on forgetting to pick up the camera and vlog. So I apologize about that, but I hope you guys still enjoyed this vlog. Please do not forget to head over to Nathan James' website and check them out. Check out their Instagram. They have a lot of beautiful furniture for affordable prices. Like I mentioned earlier, all the information will be linked down below. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you have not already, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. If you guys have any video suggestions that you guys would like me to film soon, leave them in the comments down below. I do have a few videos pre-recorded that will be going up this week. I will have a video every day up this week. I'm going to be uploading a meal prep video, a workout video, and then some more shopping videos. But if you guys have a specific shopping video or a specific like meal prep type video you guys would like me to film, let me know in the comments and I definitely will film that for you guys. Thanks so much for watching. I love you guys and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. Bye.